Hey there, everyone. It's been a while. Have you been? Well, I guess I really can't ans ask, ans ask questions, can I? Welcome back to the vibe. It's been a long time. And by that, I mean like over probably two months, I think. Has it been that long? I think so. I don't think it's been that long. Has not? Uh, How whole, one month? How long has it been? June twenty first. Oh. Yeah, we're coming it's, up on two. It sounds. It's been almost two months. Yep. It's, it's been a long time. <laughs> it's been quite um, a long time. We've been busy. Things have been busy. So. I mean, I mean I, I, we're back. We're Thanks back. For moving around. Supposedly. I've been out of the loop for almost that entire time, so I'm gonna need you guys to tell me about what news has happened. Well, <clears throat> I mean, obviously, we're back. I mean, hopefully, audience, you know who we are. I'm Joshua. That's Dondo. We have a forever guest, Iffy. Hi. Here is he. There he is. And of course, we have the, the insufferable and the guru. Yep. <laughs> there he is. Uh, <clears throat> well, I mean, I, I, I guess we should talk about what's been happening. So, out of all the things that have been happening in our lives, I feel like. Uh, yeah, I feel like Dondo, you should talk because you're the one who just had a major move. I wouldn't call it that major. You moved from you moved from a state to a different state. Yes. Yeah. I wouldn't I mean, call that major. We have different perspectives on things. I've had much larger moves than this. Major, minor, sir. What? Anyway. Who? <laughs> Whatever. <clears throat> so, I mean, yeah, you want to hear about that? I'll give you a little snippet about that. So, the main point is I finally escaped that, that horrible, horrible place known as California. And I am in a much better, much more happy place, Arizona. <laughs> <laughs> How's that going for you? No, not really different. It's about the same, really. <laughs> <laughs> the only difference is that it's so far every night here, there have been massive lightning storms. But it Sounds like Arizona. Yeah, it's a good place. It's nice and fun. Enjoyable to watch when you're awake at 3 in the morning. Which you're going to be awake at 3 in the morning if you're not used to it because it's noisy. Ah. I see. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's about it. It's been, I moved. I'm out of California. Nice. Very nice. Good. <sighs> so, Dondo moved from Cali to Airy. Uh. <laughs> that, that's, that's that. Yep. Uh. Iffy, what's new with you? I don't remember. Time lapse. <laughs> you don't remember. Left, I guess. He doesn't Things remember. happened. <laughs> mm. Glorious story. What, Almost what as good mean? as mine. <laughs> Typical. What do you mean you don't remember? I mean, I don't remember. <laughs> How do you not remember your life? I don't fucking know. Actually, I really, I really can't answer. I, re I honestly, I feel like that's very hypocritical of me because I don't even remember what I did yesterday. Oh, it just means you didn't do anything interesting. You right. <laughs> oh, it's been a I long time. I missed, I missed my soundboard. I missed it. Yeah, you could just use it out. randomly. Why not? Why not? Well, yeah. I mean, let's see. With me, I guess what's new with me. I mean, I got a job, so hmm. that's fun. You mean besides uh, this? See. This wasn't paying the bills for you? No, it 
was not. Wow. It wasn't paying. What do you? It wasn't paying me at all. What are you talking about? Who could have guessed? <laughs> uh, this is now more of a side job, I suppose. But it's not even a job. I'm, I'm just doing it for fun. I would not describe this as a job. <laughs> I know it. We would not. It's a hobby. I just said. It's a yeah. It's a hobby, more than anything. Hmm. But let's see. I mean, I, I, I mean, I don't really. Other than getting a job, let's see. What's today? The today is currently August 18th. 18th. Yeah. Yeah, today is currently August 18th. In two days, I'm finally getting uh, my driver's permit. So that's fun. Hmm. Huh. Nice. <clears throat> and then next week, my uh, my father and I are going to be going, actually going to be going down to Cali. You poor, poor for, man. For, um, for, uh... <laughs> <laughs> to go to Disneyland. Okay, might be good then. <laughs> we're bringing we're bringing jugs of water just in Disneyland. case. Disneyland. Hmm. Disneyland, yes. I enjoy Disneyland. Last time I went, I was in twenty. It was in twenty seventeen. What's your favorite part of Disneyland? My favorite part. Yeah. Well, <sighs> let's see. The last time I went to Disneyland, there were two parks that were not open yet. That was um, Avengers Campus and Galaxy's Edge. So, and now they're both open at Disneyland. So I feel like they may be my new favorites. <laughs> yeah, I just better hope they're good. I've been to Disneyland once, and uh, I gotta say I like the California Adventure Park part of it a lot better than the main park. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. But then again, Downtown Disney is also very fun. I really enjoy Downtown Disney as well. That's just like the one street with all the shops, right? It's, yeah, it's just, it's just like, downtown. <laughs> I, I, I walked through it once, saw that a hat was $37, and I didn't go back. <laughs> was it really? Yeah. Or something like that. It was expensive. Hmm. Yeah. I don't remember what shop that could have been. <laughs> it's probably all of them. A single hot dog is eight bucks. Yeah, that about explains it. Really? That and we didn't know about wow. Fast Pass, so I got to ride two things that whole weekend, and that was only because I wasn't willing to stand in line for five hours to ride a ten-minute roller coaster. I like Knott's Berry Farm a lot better because you actually get to ride the rides there. So much better. Probably because you it's gotta not get very... there late at night. What? You gotta get there late at night. I, I don't know. It really depends on uh, um. Or during a parade. Or during yeah, really it really depends on where the crowd is and when, a point in time you are at, in order to, get on rides. That's some really good grammar there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I was Rides losing will have my empty lines depending on the day and what events are happening. That's it. That's the one. That's the explosion. What? 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 what cow said? Is <laughs> in height. But uh, yeah, that's what's going on with me. Doing you land? Um, I guess that's something. I can't remember, yeah. are you going to be staying in the hotel there, or are you just going to be staying in the motel here across be, town? We're just going to be staying at a, like a, um, <clears throat> we're going to be staying at a, mo uh, uh, not a Disney-related hotel, just a hotel, like, down, like, a couple blocks from there, from the actual park. Yeah. Probably be cheaper. It's a lot cheaper. Yeah. Ugh. <sighs> How much the tickets for that place cost nowadays? Are they still like four hundred dollars? For a person? For what to for to get into the park? Yeah. Cow check. How much is a ticket to Disneyland nowadays? I don't remember. Cause last time I went, it was like two thousand. What would it have been? Two thousand eleven, and they were like three hundred some dollars. 
I think. For a ticket just to get into the park? Yeah, three hundred dollars per person. I don't remember. I don't know. Something like that. It's pricey, man. I just man. know the cost has always been too high for my family to go. Yeah, only reason we were able to go is because, I don't know, something with the school. I can't remember exactly what it was, but I think I won a raffle. And we got a coupon. Not a ticket. We got a coupon. <laughs> hmm. So I was like, eh, eh, I guess. Why not? Let's try it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I, I really don't remember the prices. It was mainly my dad who handled all that stuff. Hmm. So. And we'll have a cash check in a second. This four years ago. Four oh, years gosh, ago that you got the four. tickets. Okay. So oh, it looks like go. they've changed a little bit. Standard theme park that. ticket, $72 a day. Well, I guess we were getting a package then. Probably. Probably a family pack, Select something like that. Select number days. Price per day in U.S. dollars per One ticket. Day, it decreases per day. Yeah. Oh. You, you get five for two days. So in which case it increases. What the fuck? <laughs> well, you it know, that's probably the average amount of time people spend there. So they've got to get their it, money's worth. It's 104, then eight, then 118, then it goes back down, down to 104, 104 then, 85 then 85 at day four and, and day five at 72, and then after that they just kick you out of the park if you're not allowed to stay. <laughs> You're not allowed to stay six days. You yeah, six days in a row. <laughs> uh, California resident offer starting at 83 days. $83 a day. Which is more than your standard theme park ticket at $72 a day. Honestly, no, I, I, I read that as 83 days a dollar, and I was like... 83... $83 Good. for 83 days? You know yeah. what? <laughs> That's not That's, that's not, not bad. bad. Hang on, I think I'd live there at that point. It might be cheaper than <laughs> my <laughs> rent. $360, $360 five days, days, yeah. Oh, okay, so, yeah. Yeah, makes sense. No scope. <laughs> that, that, that is pretty good. But that's for one person. That, that, yeah, that's for, that's for one person. person. Five days for $360 for one person. Yeah. That's for one person. Yeah. Yikes. So, I don't know if it's gone down or if I'm just not remembering right, because I was like 11 years old, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember. <sighs> yeah, the, the food and the merch is all separate thing, of course. Yeah. I don't because know. Because there are, um... Oh, what are they? There are dining plans that you're able to get. <laughs> there are? Yeah, there are dining plans that you're able to get when you're um, purchasing your tickets and selecting the days like four, five, six months in advance before you go. Well, so what, they like come on the intercom over the park and tell you that it's your feeding it's time? It's, it's a reservation is what it is because, you know, it's very... Uh, it's, it's very... What's the word? Popular, crowded. Yes, that's it. It's crowded. very popular and it's very crowded. Yeah. So, there are dining plans and they're basically the reservations that you can. Get. Yeah. I don't really think I want to eat there though. I have, for one reason, I was I had tried. We had. Ah, <sighs> breathe. Okay, so when I went there, we went to one of the restaurants in the California Adventure Park, and I got a plate of ribs. Immediately got sick afterwards. And oh. again, that was both 2011 and you were in California Adventure. Which is across the street from Disney. I know, but then again... It's still Disney Parks. Down hey, downtown Disney has a, a lot of other restaurants. Uh, yeah, they were like and... ten times as expensive. That's why I went to the California Adventure Park. I've been there, though. Hmm... There was, there was one, there was one particular restaurant in downtown Disney that I'm trying to remember. It was uh, very enjoy- I don't, I don't even remember its name. I wish I did. Hmm. Yeah, I don't it know was... what it is. <gasps> I 
don't remember. And we'll have Cal pull up a list of downtown Disney restaurants. Exclusive. And oh, yeah. Apparently there's an exclusive club that you can join, which helps you pay more money for the tickets. Mm -hmm. Yep. Something yeah, like probably. That. I don't know, it was always like the Disney movies for me. Okay, according to Cal, and I quote, the invite-only membership has a waitlist that has been opened and closed over the years due to high demand. According to one Club 33 member, there is a $25,000 to $100,000 initiation fee and $12,500 to $30,000 annual fee depending on the level of membership. So yes, not only are you spending $360 per person for a week, you're also spending hundred grand a year. Hundred grand plus another thirty grand a year just to be there. What are your benefits, Cal? Let me guess, nothing. Or if you get branded by Walt Disney himself. I don't know. I think I'm kind of branded already, considering. You get uh, to be his personal slave. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Eh, sounds like it's worth one hundred and thirty thousand dollars. <laughs> of course, with that money, I could get, you know, two. Sennheiser Orpheus. I mean, that'd be, you know, that'd be better. <laughs> and it's for rich people. Okay, so apparently there's not a lot of perks. It, it's just very, to it's say that you... limited for the middle class. No, 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 I mean, this... The Club 33 member, apparently there's not a lot of perks. It's just you can brag about how you were able to burn $130,000 for nothing. You're, you're able to brag about how you're part of Club 33. Which doesn't do you anything, from what I know. It's about like the same as saying, "Hey, I'm a host on the Vibe." <laughs> Except that's <laughs> free. <laughs> and the what bunch did you of say? Other stuff. You gotta go to secret areas. Oh, you mean like that rundown, haunted, destroyed Disney park in Florida? You get to see the corpse of Mickey Mouse in the part in the flesh. Oh my. Perhaps, Perhaps. says Cal. <laughs> It's very secretive, so apparently it is just a cult. Maybe you get to uh, rub the frozen head of Walt Disney. What are your guys' uh, favorite Disney uh, movie? My favorite Disney movie? I can't even remember what Disney movies are Disney movies. Cow. Are we List are we every included? Disney movie made. <laughs> I can't remember. Pixar is Disney, by the way. Okay. Uh, okay, so we can pick Pixar? Nice. Pixar, okay. I know my favorite. So I guess that also it includes... Me, that also includes Marvel, then. What? And Star Wars. And Star Wars. Oh, frick, I forgot. Hold on, I'm gonna cheat. Oh, no. I'm gonna go look at the Disney Plus catalog. <laughs> Disney Plus. As a princess and the frog, it was their um, last hand in the film. That's hey. true. I'm, just, I'm still looking. I'm still looking. Couldn't you see? The catalog won't show everything. That's no. true, Cal. You know what it does show, though? It shows. <laughs> it shows Garfield 2004. Oh yeah, that's. You know on the Disney live Plus. action one. <laughs> that's on Disney Plus now. I forgot. And Beverly Hills Chihuahua, and a whole bunch of oh other gosh, stuff. Those movies. Uh, Playlist of Walt Disney movies. IMDb. 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 <laughs> All right, second Looking monitor. Here we go. All right, we got first things first: Snow White, Pinocchio, Fantasia, Reluctant Dragon, Dumbo, Bambi, Victory Through Air Power. What? Animated documentary proposing the soundness of strategic aerial bombing in World War II. I found my favorite. What? The f <laughs> what? 1943. Uh huh. I like this one. Is this one on Disney Plus? Victory Through Air Power. Ooh. No, it's not on Disney Plus, and I find that to be quite a disappointment. Gosh, do you have a favorite Disney movie? That's a good question. Is it Victory Through Air Power? <laughs> Saludos, amigos. The Three Caballeros. Make mine music. Song of the South. Fun and fancy free. So dear to my heart. There's a lot of these from. I've never heard about. Huh. Treasure Island, yeah. Cinderella. Cinderella's from 1950. Cinderella.
rally, Cinder rally, night and day, it's Cinder rally. Yeah, it yeah. is. Huh. Oh. I probably like Alice in Wonderland the best, personally. I haven't seen that in a long time. Yeah. Me um. I mean, you know, it's either that or... God, there's a lot of these. Oh, Lady in the Tramp, that's a good one. I like oh, Lady yeah. in the Tramp. It's only 76 minutes. 76. Huh. 66. Jesus, there are a lot. There's a lot of these. Yeah. Kind of short, isn't it? Well, I guess. You know what? Now that I'm saying it out loud, it kind of is. But... Yeah, 90 minute standard wasn't a thing in the 50s, apparently. True. And then they got other stuff. God, there's a lot. This is a long list. This never ends. <laughs> Disney for you. Well, hey, this list is incomplete. It only goes up to 1972. Cow. Why? Look at I am. <laughs> the list only goes up to 1972. Are you on the IMDb list? Yes. Oh. I'm going back to Disney Plus to check the more modern stuff. Like, uh. Oh, wow, there's a That's lot of stuff that I. Never heard of on here actually. There's a Toy Story 4? Yeah. <laughs> did you not know? When that? did that come out? 2019? Two, two, two years ago. <laughs> Why? Huh. How did you not know about that? I, I don't know. I just didn't, I guess. There's a lot of stuff on here that what I have never heard about. about. The, IM, the IMDB list goes all the way to... Oh, yes. It. That's if you hit the next button. I want it all on one page. Yeah, it goes up. It goes all the way. Yeah, but what if you don't want to hit the next button? E well, then you're lazy. <laughs> sure, sure. The shaggy dog, eat below, wild, <laughs> Pirates, of the, Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess that is Disney, isn't it? Johnny Depp's a weird guy. <laughs> Cannot take him seriously. What am I looking at? My, what? Oh. Ooh, Herbie. Enchanted. Return Ratatouille. from which mountain? Okay. Ratatouille. Oh, we're in 2000. What? Who? Where? Why? 1978. 2007? That doesn't okay. feel right. I feel like it's older than that. It's Ratatouille, right? Ratatouille is 2007. This episode's gonna be like 90% just us yelling random Disney. <laughs> Dragon Slayer! <laughs> High School Musical 3, senior year. Condo Man. Condor Man. I would like to point out that this list is <gasps> so many pages long. Shh. Of Narnia. Quiet. I like Tron, 1982. Best CGI I've ever seen. No cap. Chronicles of Narnia existed. I forgot about that. Tiger Town, there we go. Alright, we need to, uh... We need to move on. <laughs> Back to theme parks. I like Legoland. I've been to Legoland either. Still too expensive. You've been, you've been, been to Legoland? Yes. I haven't been to, like, any theme parks. Uh, oh, I thought you said you have been to Legoland. I was like, oh, I wish. My family's poor. <laughs> poor that. Uh, mm -hmm. Ooh, the Nightmare Before Christmas. And uh, what is the other one? The Corpse Bride. Those are good. The Secret of the Magic Gourd. What am I looking at? Oh, that sounds familiar. Okay. Tomorrowland. Oh, Tomorrowland. I forgot that existed. I didn't even know what that is. I don't see all the ads for it. Operation Dumbo Drop? The uh, big uh, green. Uh, uh. Hold on, I'm sorry, what? Why are you, what, who, where, huh? why, what? Anyway, D3 the Mighty Duck, and no, no, you focus, focus. <laughs> Something else. <laughs> Anything else, please, pull me away from this. 
get out of the app or the, the thing, whatever you want. The, the wonderful world of Disney's Tower of Terror. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's a TV series, 1995-2005? They just picked one episode from 1997. God. Ooh. George of the Jungle. <laughs> oh my god, you got me there. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. George of the Jungle. One. <laughs> Meta score of 53? Oh, IMDB, you are a. You're a. You're a. Mm. You, you don't have any class. How is Flubber 37 Meta score? <laughs> What, what, first off, what year did this come out? I'm just so I can... Okay, I won't be wrong with this. It was probably like 2006, right? I went to my local library and rented out this ancient thing that you two have probably never heard of, considering how young you are. A VHS tape. We're oh, not that like young. Like, 150 of those, and they're all Disney. <laughs> I was gonna say, I have so many of those. Good. Now... <laughs> A year and a half younger than you. Bruh. <laughs> I'm two years younger than you. We're not that young. I don't really want you to make fun of me for being old. <laughs> because you are. <laughs> I never forget. <laughs> anyway. Uh, what was this? Existential crisis. I forgot. Shut it, cow. <laughs> Anyway. Wait, <laughs> you have a story about what Flubber? Yeah. Yeah, the VHS was Flubber. <laughs> That's the end of it. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay. I just I, I miss I miss when libraries let you rent out tapes. That was good. I miss when we had libraries. What do you mean? You don't have libraries anymore? Not that I don't know where my local library is. It's downtown. I have to take you to it sometime. There's two of them. The one downtown what? is the only good one. That is true. That one has a significantly larger selection. It's like the difference of between having three stories of books versus like having a... two rooms, maybe. Yeah. Can you consider Barnes and Noble a library? Are the books free? No. no. Then it's not a no. library. <laughs> Get back to what, what were we talking about? Theme Libraries. <laughs> potatoes. Uh, potatoes on the 4th of July. Ate half a raw potato so I could fit a firework in it to make it explode. Kids don't do that. It was a lot of fun, but kids don't do that. Kids. Hold the a whole, a whole. Make sure you have a parent's permission and supervision. Don't. <laughs> I... If you lived, they'll be fine. <laughs> They're the spinny ones, so it didn't explode, it just like spun over the ground. Oh. A little bit of air, too, that's nice. <laughs> Wait. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm just, I, I'm too confused to understand what you're talking Flying about. Flying potato of <laughs> flames. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Why didn't you cut a hole in a potato? He did. I had, I had my face. Yeah. And I used it. He used his teeth. It was tasty, I like potatoes. Raw? Well, obviously not as much You're as cooked, idiot. but I'll still eat it. <laughs> <laughs> they do be edible, though. Sometimes. Not, not always, you can still right. test that theory. <laughs> yeah, don't eat raw potatoes, there. I am a professional idiot, this is what I do. Don't try that at home. <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> uh, interesting. Well... Hey, that made me think about Roman candles. <laughs> That's Those so random. <laughs> what, fireworks, That's potatoes, and Roman candles? Oh. It's not that big a stretch. Are you talking about going from potatoes to Roman candles? Yeah, except his potato had a firework in it. Yes. Yeah. Well, it had three. Three? 
and it didn't yeah. explode. I got it to spin. Mm. Did, did, and get some air. Did, Wait, Spirited did, Away is a Disney movie? Spirited what? Away? Yes. No. Does Disney... No. Maybe. Yes. Maybe. I don't know. Wait, does Disney own Studio Ghibli? Probably. Huh. Disney owns, like, everything. That's fair. Disney brought it to the U.S. Oh, localization. Anyway, I don't like that one very much, but I like Castle in the Sky pretty good. <laughs> Castle in the Sky. <laughs> that is not how the song that. goes. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was just singing the English name. English voice actors were gathered by Disney. That said. Yeah, they did the localization. Anyway, whatever. Back to what we're talking about. Fireworks. No. <laughs> Roman candles, the best kind, no, because you can no, strap like four what? of them to your arm with tape, and then you can just shoot it off like Iron Man. <laughs> what are we talking about theme parks? Oh yeah, we can go back to that. Anyway, Legoland's better than Disneyland. Don't you can fight me on this, but you won't win. Have you been? I've been to both of these. Oh, okay. I've never been to Legoland. I want to. Wait, what? What? I know. I ah. as, 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 ter as terrible as it might sound, me being a Lego fanatic has, has never been to Legoland. Bro. What the hell? <laughs> How? That's... <laughs> I am shell-shocked. to walk around Legoland. It's not that bad, Cat. Don't worry about it. But all oh, the the uh, the place where they build like the, the cities out of Legos. They have like the thing of New York. They have one of you are stepping on Legos. Tokyo. No, not always. Just when you're walking through the Lego cities. And then the go karts, where it's not really a go kart like bumper cars. It's just they have a bunch of Lego cars. They're go karts, and then they have like just city streets and Lego buildings. And you just drive around obeying the laws of traffic. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I remember seeing that. The only like, reason I read, only reason, only reason I kept uh, went on that one because the line was really short. <laughs> well, I was waiting for the line. <laughs> the reason because you're obeying the laws of traffic <laughs> until you don't, and then they bring out the Lego cop cars, <laughs> which they don't actually do. Funny if they did. It would be great if they did, but then that's all you'd ever see. That's true. Which would make it infinitely better, but... <laughs> oh, you know, Lego police GTA. chases. Lego, yeah, Lego GTA. <laughs> Go over and beat someone with a Lego baseball bat and pull them out of their car. Then you get into a fist fight in the middle of the street before getting run over by the cops in the Lego car. Yo, guys, I got a new game. Do you want to come over to my house and play um, Grand Theft Lego? <laughs> Get blown up by a Lego tank. Yep. <laughs> Fly a Lego jet. Mm, right into the Lego Twin Towers. Be pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I would love to fly a Lego jet. Well, Josh, if you really want that experience, you could always get Forza Horizon 4 and the Lego Cars DLC, and you can drive around in a Lego <gasps> Ferraris. <laughs> That sounds fun. It's amazing. Not only because, well, I, I didn't bother buying any of the DLC for that game because the base game alone has given me like 200 hours of random bullshit and driving around. It's the best racing game I have played in a long, long time. Forza Horizon 4. Hmm. Isn't there, isn't there a fifth one? Or am I mistaken? I think it's coming out within a year. It was announced recently, maybe? I don't know. I've been out of the loop for so long. <sighs> For almost two months. Two months, and I'm that. probably a little bit longer than that because I was prepping to move. It's been a while. <laughs> like that. It's been a while since you've known stuff. Pretty basically. much since the last episode, now that I think about it. <laughs> Talked about Star Wars Squadrons. Do you remember that? Sort of, yes. Does that game still exist? <laughs> it exists. I don't know what it's... Uh, Right. Current player basis is. But huh. It's not it super huge, but 
it's okay. Does it have I, enough? I know someone who plays it like all the time. Or yeah, we had a mod last time. Are there still enough people in there for a single game to start? Because if so, then it's not dead yet. Supposedly, yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Because I was gonna say over that time, I was over since that time, I actually got the game and played it. It's oh, it's fun, but. Eh, there's not really that much to do. Yeah, I remember um, <laughs> that month. Um, it was one of the free games for PlayStation Plus. Yeah, that's how I got it. I went into one match online, got 12 and 0, positive KD, and then lost the match somehow. <laughs> <laughs> Makes sense. The, the guy that. Like Valorant. The second guy was. It, it's like teams of 5 or 6. Right? Teams I'm just, of five. Teams of five. I was, you know, was just playing solo and multiplayer, so it was four other guys that died like six times each. And then the enemy team, they had like, each? their top guy was like eight kills, fit, like six deaths. And I was over here rocking 12 and 215 players right now. I just, wow. Oh, yeah, that's getting, it's getting kind of low. If they, if EA decided to add more eras and more things to do, then that number would probably be in the thousands. But Josh, EA they, said explicitly they would never add anything to the game. They would release you, it and then let it die. <laughs> <laughs> that is true, that is true. I mean, they only spent, what, six million dollars on it? It's nothing. Ah, <laughs> cow, how much did Squadrons cost to make? Oh, that is true, they did do that, they did do that. Okay, apparently they added- And then TIE Defenders became, like, incredibly OP, though. Yeah, they, apparently they added TIE Defenders and B-Wings. You can't just respond to Cow, he doesn't have a voice, you have to, you have to read it out first. Ah, fine. <laughs> <laughs> He's not using his voice. Sure. Yeah. But, yeah, I, I... That's also Disney, right? What, Star Squadrons? Star Wars. Star Wars, yes. Yeah. Still. Marvel's, Mar so, uh, Marvel is Disney, Star Wars is Disney, Pixar is Disney, National Geographic is Disney. Huh? And Disney is Disney. Yeah, that's weird. They got a bunch of, like, news channels and things, too. Nah, who doesn't? Me. As well as... Well yeah. as there's also the Disney Plus bundle, which includes ESPN, Hulu and ESPN. Hulu. I don't think that yeah. counts, though. Like, they don't actually so. own that. They're partners. Have ESPN and Hulu, but not Disney Plus. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't read the bundle. Wow. Wow. Sorry, there was there was a tiny spider on my mic. I had to blow it off. <laughs> nice. It's another thing. There's not a lot of bugs down here. Mm. Yeah, there's not a lot of bugs down here. Be, I figured there'd be more spiders. There's not. There's Harry? just. Yeah. There's just a lot of Did cicadas. You for that? No. I feel no. like spiders would be more prominent and airy considering that it's warmer. Yeah, that's usually how it works. Because when I lived in Southern California, there was. Everything around there, spiders, tarantulas, because those are, I guess, and also scorpions, but I haven't seen any of those here. Yeah. Which I'm thankful for, I because I despise tarantulas, they're evil. I, my mother owned a pet tarantula when she was younger. That's a horror story, don't ever say that again. <laughs> That's that sounds awful. <laughs> I can't imagine You're that. Up and find it on your face. <laughs> uh, hey, she owned it when she was like, I don't know, maybe six years old. Why? Something like that. That's like I something you would do in your edgy preteen years. You're 13, like, yeah, I want a dangerous pet. I got a snake and a spider. Her father was from Texas. That doesn't make anything different. <laughs> it's not difference there. It's just weird. Why would you want a spider? It's just, it's just weird. <laughs> oh. But that, no, I, I can't talk anymore after that. We're gonna have to end it there. I don't like tarantulas. Or other spiders, they're fine. I'll smash them all day. Tarantulas, no. Don't want to look at them. They're evil. And at that... Shoot their hairs into your face. 
Yeah, they do. And they eat birds. Yep. They don't drink their blood. They they're, just eat the birds. They're big. Yeah, they're, they're big. It's awful. It's terrible. The only benefit to them being that big is you can actually shoot them and not miss. <laughs> uh, Alright, at that I'm calling it there. I can't do it. No more spiders. <laughs> Alright, well, oh! Die, God. cow! <laughs> <laughs> They're so hairy. Yep. There we go. Fixed it. <laughs> Alright, at that, I'm gonna call it good. This has been... The Vibe with your hosts, Dondo, Josh, and we'll just call you a host from now on. It's gotten to that point anyway. Iffy uh, out there. <laughs> you know, I can't rejoin. Bye, <laughs> <laughs> uh, everyone. Peace out. Goodbye, everyone.